Hello, students. It's me, Mr. T. Hope you guys are doing great. Miss seeing all of you. Um, this week's assignment is going to use a um, recording that I've done for you and an assignment sheet that you can access to play the assignment from. Uh, from Classroom, there is a link to this page. Once you are here, you can open up the assignment music that you'll need to perform the assignment. And you will see that if you scroll down, you'll find your part. And you can either print it out or you can play from this page. Now, I want you to prepare this assignment um, with a couple of things in mind. Make sure that you look at your key signature. You look at the time signature, which is in cut time. Your articulations, sometimes we have staccatos, we have slurs, we have some dynamic changes throughout, um, and I'd like you to include all of those. You might need to prepare this over the next couple of days, so take a little bit each day. It is due on Saturday the 11th. To help you prepare, I have created a couple of recordings for you that you can use to play along with. <clears throat> um, I've done it at a slow tempo, a medium tempo, and a fast tempo. If you click on the slow tempo recording, it'll take you to a video <clears throat> which will give you an idea of how the piece is supposed to be played. This is just a sample, so it's not your instrument. It might be your instrument, but in most cases it is not. This is from a smart music recording. If you have smart music, you can do it right in smart music as well. But uh, this will do for those of you who don't. I'm going to share some information about smart music um, in a, about a day or so here to see if we can get ourselves all hooked up to that. But that's the recording. You can use that to practice with. You can stop it along the way and you can um, practice short bits of it. Um, when you are ready to record, I would like you to record it at your best tempo. The slow tempo might be a good learning tempo for most of you, but I would prefer to hear it at the medium or fast tempo. Um, for some of the more advanced players, and you know who you are, I would like you to shoot for the fast tempo. If you choose to do it without the recording, you can just simply set your metronome to a speed which um, you feel is comfortable for you. However, at the slow recording tempo, the tempo is shown to you up here in uh, the upper left hand portion. If you open up your screen, there's your tempo. This one's at 60. The others are set to the, their particular tempo. So it has to be within that. When you're ready to record, you're going to do that in Seesaw. So log into the Seesaw page where I will have a place for you to um, put your recording. If you have any questions, you can always email me or uh, send me a message through Classroom, and I will be more than happy to help you out. Hope that helps, and I will talk with you soon.